CNN fakes location report after Brian Williams discussion. So classic. They cut from Brian Williams to uh, talk of uh, Ukraine, where they got caught two years ago with uh, a guy going, are you ready for me to fake the shooting? Okay, start shooting, claim dead bodies. And then they would, I mean, it's, just, it's a joke. That was Anderson Cooper again. They're all a bunch of Brian Williams liars, in my view. The term surreal may not adequately describe the continuing national coverage of the ever-developing Brian Williams saga. And sandwiched in between talk of that, they have the reporters saying that they're in Ukraine and they're not, and then the green screen breaks up. This doesn't translate well, obviously, because it's visual for radio, but let's go ahead and play it just so it's on the record. Here it is. The very segment after discussing Brian Williams, CNN and Anderson Cooper look to have been bitten by the green screen bug yet again. This time, however, from the other side of the so-called news desk, Cooper doing the interviewing with CNN international correspondent Nick Patton Walsh, supposedly reporting from the front lines of the Ukrainian civil war, except with half of what looks to have been a much shortened interview being marred by visions of the most common blue and green screen or chroma key colors, swiping across the actor in certain shots as he attempts to keep the public in the dark about what's actually going on. But glitching on CNN and the grand deceivers of the mainstream media in perhaps the most revealing moment possible, the very segment after discussing Brian Williams, showing anyone who cares just how little credibility they have left and why the mainstream media's ratings continue to decline despite a rapid growth in the amount of potential TV viewers during that same time frame. We tried to reach CNN and Anderson Cooper to find out if they had any comments about the most recent green screen escapade. Not surprisingly, to little avail. We assume, however, had we been able to reach someone at CNN to talk about the most recent example of official news fabrication and embellishment, we'd likely have received some sort of undesired response anyway. Thanks again for tuning in to The Conspiracy Examiner. I'm Jeffrey Phelps with Examiner.com. And remember to like and share these articles and videos to all corners of the real world. All right. And we'll see you next time. Very exciting to see other great reporters out there watching and tracking all this. We need more people getting the word out, not less. We ought to get that guy to do some work for us. That's a good, clean report, and that's how you expose the enemy.